This video is proudly recorded and produced on OpenBSD. Let's say you are addicted to my content and you cannot get enough of the OpenBSD guy's content. And one way to battle this problematic problem is to block the youtube.com domain so that you can recover from this bad habit of keep watching my videos. I know for the fact that I make dope videos, I am even addicted to myself and to my content. But joke aside, let's talk about the main topic of this video. So what we want to achieve is to add a block list or to have a block list that blocks certain websites is a simple DNS blocking. And so for that one, we are going to utilize unwind in case that you don't know what the unwind is you can watch the video on the top right corner there i made simple explanation about the unwind and how to get a start with it so let's begin of course we are not going to use youtube as an example here because you know what i really need your watch hours and I'm, i want to monetize my channel but joke aside i don't care whether you watch or no it's entirely up to you but we are going to use another stupid website in this case we are going to use facebook just for fun and maybe just to shame mark zuckerberg slightly so what we are going to do first we are going to create a block list file this one should be under etsy directory so do as we slash etsy block list and then we are going to add the website that we want to block or the websites. So in this case, facebook.com and then www.facebook.com. So this is the first step. The second step is to modify the unwind.com file. And that one also is under Etsy director. So do as wim slash etc unwind.conf. And the important thing is to add this configuration at the first line. So we are going to add block list, then pass the location of the block list file. In this case, let's see block list. And then lastly, we can pass an optional flag of log. So if we add this one, we can actually go and observe the logs. So we do that and finally we have to actually reload the configuration so unwind ctl reload so now the configuration is reloaded so if we go to the browser and try to open something like a facebook.com it will fail and if we try to open the www.facebook.com it doesn't reach fantastic so now what we can do, we can go and have a look at the log. So the log is stored uh, under daemon file uh, in the slash war slash log. So tail dash f slash war slash log and then daemon. And as you can see here, configuration reloaded. This is when we reloaded the configuration blocking facebook.com last message repeated three times and blocking www.facebook.com that's all for this video i hope you enjoyed it i would like to take a moment to thank patreon contributors grog with 30 generous dollar a stellar orbit with 20 generous dollar openbsc maximalist alexander m monty russell willis openbsc enthusiast dm john collins liquid mobius and openbsc curious sector